Hello, what's up guys? My name is Dmitry, I'm a filmmaker from Ukraine based in Manila. And I'm back with a lot of new reviews and commercial content. For the past months I received a bunch of products from different companies. They sent to me those products in exchange for review, but they didn't pay to me. That means I'll share with you guys my honest opinion and user experience. Also during this time I've used most of those products in real scenario commercial shoots. So I'll be able to share with you some backstage scenes and of course uh, sample footage as well. So today I'm reviewing and comparing two professional shotgun microphones. It's Boya BM6040 and BM6060. So it comes in a case. So here is the microphone. It comes with a windscreen it's pretty compact then it comes with four windshield it comes in a case then it comes with a holder let's check it out here it is with foam they're really great microphones, suitable for indie films, documentaries, for interview recording, recording sound effects, all the sounds that happening on your scene. They're really high quality directional microphones for those purposes. Comparing to a regular shotgun microphone, on camera microphone, uh, they're much more sensitive. That means they require much less gain at the same scene to record the same volume of sound. They have XLR input, so Boya 6040 is cardioid and 6060 is super cardioid. It's rocked with alloy aluminum construction that ensures great pre-interference capability during recording. Boya 6040 delivers a great exceptional sound reproduction with full lows, clear, and precise mids and crisp highs. There is also built-in high-pass filter, 150 Gz, that minimizes unwanted noise. Boya 6040 has cardioid polar pattern, that means it's really directional. It's just recording everything that in front of you and uh, it avoids all unnecessary sound that surrounds you. This is a mono microphone, that's suitable for standard boom pole or boom mount. Frequency range is from 90 Hz to 20 kHz. Output impedance of Boya 6040 is 100 ohm, comparing to 6060 it's 200 ohm. While Boya 6040 is powered by XLR Phantom Power, Boya 6060 can be powered by XLR Phantom Power as well as with AA battery. Here are some samples that I did. Real scenario shoots. La famiglia ti riconoscente. Questo è stato un affare grosso. Spasiba, gli sto Torna domani. Parleremo del tuo futuro. Angelo. Тони, садись. Тони, ты снова одет, как мальчик из церковного хора. Все уже давно знают, кто ты и что ты. Сменяй одежду. Как наши дела? На фото, Макс. Тут он натули еще, но ты тебе прикупал. Also, I received suspension shock mount Boya C30. It's really useful, it's convenient to use. It has a hot shoe mount, it's really easy to install and I just mount the microphone. It's lightweight, it's durable, it's adjustable uh, in terms of position. How the suspension reduces all the unnecessary uh, vibrations. One, two, three, four, five. Microphone test of C30 shock mount. I was able to test and compare two microphones at the same time. Let's do some comparison tests of them. So right now I'm testing Boya BY BM6040 cardioid short shotgun microphone. One, two, three, four, five. I'm testing Boya BY6040 
shotgun microphone. It's mounted on the distance of 20 centimeters above me with 45 degrees angle. One, two, three, four, five. I'm testing Boya BY 6060 Super Cardioid Condenser Shotgun Microphone. One, two, three, four, five. Mic test. I'm testing Boya BY BM 6060 Super Cardioid Condenser Shotgun Microphone. It's slightly longer than 6040. Right now it's mounted above me. show it okay so it's here just on the distance around like 15 centimeters above me 45 degrees as well it has uh, absolutely same gain it's 5 on uh, zoom h5 recorder if you want to connect it to blackmagic camera for this one input you may need this adapter. This is XLR to mini XLR adapter. Just plug it in to the camera and then you go to settings XLR and on the right just the same XLR microphone. Then you turn on phantom power, adjust the gain and actually you're ready to go. And this is how it sounds when Boya 6040 is mounted with suspension shock mount on the camera itself and then connected with XLR cable with XLR adapter to mini XLR connected to Blackmagic 4K. And right now I'm testing the direction of the sound of 6040. One, two, three, four, five. I'm speaking right now pointing to 6040 and then I go around the microphone. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to the right of the microphone. Right now I'm exactly behind of the microphone. And then right now I'm on the left side of the microphone. And then right now I'm again here in the front of the microphone. So it should record my volume, my voice in the best way. The distance right now is around 50 centimeters. I guess a yeah, half meter it should be. Or you simply go with zoom recorder that has XLR input. Then you just simply connect your XLR to zoom recorder. Yeah, right now it's no SD card, but anyway. And then you select one or two uh, first or second channel. This is first and this is second. You can connect up to two XLRs. So basically I can plug in two of the microphones just in one recorder. Yeah. And you're ready to roll. Also I tested with Fury wind protection. Uh, with regular foam windshield I still can feel the turbulence from fans. But when you use Fury windshield Sound is really clear, no problems at all. One, two, three, four, five. I'm just sitting nearby uh, the fan on the maximum power and I'm recording my sound with a Fury windshield. And then under the Fury windshield, there is a foam windshield on the microphone, Boya 6060. So right now, I guess, you definitely hear the difference in terms of audio quality. Uh, I'm recording the sound of Boya 6060 and right now I will direct the microphone to the fan. And I guess you probably will hear the overload. So right now you definitely hear the overload. It, it's just impossible to use the microphone with a huge amount of wind. So right now I'm recording the sound on Boya 6040. Definitely can see how close it is to the uh, fan. Fan is working on the maximum power and uh, you definitely can hear my voice very clear. So 
what I mean is uh, this Fury windshield works pretty awesome. For example, I r I'll direct the microphone right now to the fan itself. Uh, I guess in this case you can hear the sound of a uh, moving fan of rotating fan but you don't hear the overload okay so right now um, as I hear in headphones in earphones the sound is a little bit more crisp but there is much more overload and from what I can see on Zoom H5 recorder there is and definitely overload so right now you definitely cannot use this audio anymore because it's already spoiled with the wind. Well, let's go to conclusions. Which microphone would I choose from those two? Uh, to be honest, I never been the audio guy. I was doing videos, I was doing visual content as well, always. And then I don't know how it happened, but I got different microphones from different companies for testing, for reviews. And then I was able to compare all of them and uh, most of them performed really great but when I compared it to Boya 6040 I was so impressed in terms of quality. I was walking around my unit, around the street, you know, just to record in the sound, just to listen to the sound. I was, you know, scratching the paper boiling water and I did I just did some different sound effects and I just checked how it sounds and all the way I was enjoying it so much so Boya 6040 personally for me it just opened the world of high quality audio so after that I cannot go any lower this is really deal breaker this is really high quality audio for the low amount of price and uh, you guys can decide which is better for you anyway both microphones are really great thank you guys for watching stay tuned for new content i have a lot of reviews upcoming and i have a lot of also commercial projects to be posted on my youtube channel as vimeo as instagram and facebook everywhere everywhere just subscribe make sure you hit the subscribe button if you have any questions, any suggestions, just leave your comment below in comment section. If you have any questions, any suggestions, just leave your comment below in comment section. I'm trying to reply to everyone. Thank you and take care guys. Bye.